Hello everybody, I'm Sir, and we're going to play the next daily challenge for XCOM 2, War of the Chosen, for uh, October the 4th, I believe. Looks like we got five uh, Lieutenant Rangers, which will be interesting, and we're going up against quote-unquote puppeteers, which I think will also be a lot of fun. Just have to destroy a relay, which hopefully we'll be able to do no problem. I'm hoping today we can actually get into the challenge, as we couldn't again yesterday. Uh, I did watch the guy who was first place. Um, for the day, and he still didn't have very good scores, like 10,000 or something like that. And uh, of course, you know, XCOM crashed by the time I got out of, by before the replay finished, so I don't know exactly how it ended, but it didn't look like it was going to end well. Um, just, just, oof, it's painful. We're operating in the hey, we're in today. Relay is up ahead. Move in and destroy the target. But I think the next time I just get kicked out automatically, I might just watch whoever's in the lead at the time. That way, at least there's something to watch. Even if it's just my commentary or somebody else's play, at least there's at least we can still hopefully experience it. But we'll see. Maybe it will never happen again. Maybe. Yada yada yada. Destroy transmitter. All right. We're gonna consume it. Hey, we got power armor. We got what kind of gun is that? Storm guns. Oh, okay then. That hopefully does change some things. We are kind of far away. Confirmed. How much vision do we have over here? Can we get up there? No, not really. All right. On the move. We'll do. Let's just get people going. Solid copy. Got it. Moving. We got fusion blades, too. I have to try to pay attention and see if anybody has uh, Ooh, that's terrible pathing. It's terrible pathing. Moving to designated position. Anyone has like Blade Master and things like that. They all got different stuff. Some people have Phantom, which will be interesting. Um, you? Yes. Go, go, Let's get go. there and get a good look at everybody we're facing. Oh, come on. That, that's terrible. Love the loss and just how they're positioned. They've seen me. Well, he had Phantom. I don't really care. Uh, I'm sure somebody else has Phantom as well. What is this nonsense? We can't use the Shredder gun though. There's lost everywhere. Uh, I'm kind of not so concerned. I would really like to kill one of these guys if I could. Uh, that seems like it would be easier said than done. Almost everybody has run and gun though, which is kind of awesome. Oh. You don't have running gun though, which is not awesome. Nor do you have blade storm. You have shadow strike, which uh, is not going to do me any good now. I mean, you have conceal that I could use later, I suppose. Uh, let's see. Maybe I'll catch him on fire. Uh, this isn't a really good start. Yay! Fire. You have shadow strike. That's fine. Run and gun. I might run and gun you up there. I mean, I really do want to keep move, moving. Move, we have six turns to get over there and shoot that thing a couple times. Yes, perfect. Fantastic work. Uh, he sh ah, he's got one. He could have one health left. I guarantee you it's going to happen. Just because of reasons. This is all terrible place to go. You are not... Concealment, that's fine. Shadow step. Makes more sense. I could kill you, but I'm worried about what's over there. How worried am I? Uh, not worried enough, I guess. I probably should be more worried. I don't see anybody behind him. Hey! Hey! We're alright. All right. Bonus chance to crit, yada, yada, yada. It's really gonna leave you out in the open though. Yeah, screw it. Kinda don't care, I just kinda really wanna get these uh, people killed. They're on to me. Like, next turn, I want all these guys dead. And we crit. And you burned, you're gonna stasis. That's fine. You're gonna burn. They changed the way burning works. I'm not sure anymore. It used to be you couldn't melee, you couldn't do anything, you could only shoot. Uh, 
Um, perhaps that is indeed the case, though. They do appear to be all over you. Um, who else has conceal? Conceal. Conceal. You do. And you do. Alright, let's move you up and shoot you in the face, because it'll be funny. Hilarious. It is hilarious, though. Good job. Aren't our way to just making boatloads of money. We're gonna come down here and overwatch. So that way when he pops up, we'll shoot him. Done deal. Uh, let's reconceal you so we can see what's going on. Yes. Oh, son of a bitch. Are you kidding me? How does that count? That's ridiculous. That is ridiculous. Uh, okay, I guess we'll move you up, but not too much because... We can't conceal there, there, see ya. Concealed. Oh, game. I've been having a lot of problems lately with XCOM, just uh, spawning lots and lots of... Um, on the move. Pretty much all the pods, not just lots, but all the pods yeah, on top of each other in maps. Um, which, if you've been watching my XCOM 2 series, or the War of the Chosen series, I should say, you will have noted that, but... It's ridiculous. Also, that fire should have counted. Pop. No, I didn't expect that one to hit. I did expect that one to hit. Hmm. What are you gonna do? Stasis him? That's fine, I'll shoot you in the face anyways. It's gonna stink because he's gonna be so far behind everybody, but... Uh, is there somebody up here? Oh yeah, there's people right there. Well, that kind of figures. We kind of figured that, to be honest, right? To what are your chances to shoot him? Not that great. What about cutting him open? What if you gut him like a fish? 81? It's terrible. Finally, someone's getting the job done. We lost 100 points for killing him a turn later. Disgusting. Also, you're right on the edge of sight for them. Let's use you and figure out where people really are. On the move. How many are really in this pod? I feel like there's more people just hiding. You're all lying to me. We're close. Like, I don't want to uh uh, that could be a lot of fun, actually. I don't want to move like up here and have there be like someone right there that uh, does actually see that spot. And it's just a filthy liar. That's right. For right now, let's just try to get... Well, we can't really get everyone together, I guess, because they're frozen and bubbles and standing behind us. But anyways, the, I, it's got to be a bug. There'll just be three pods on top of each other, and they're always right on top of the objective. It cannot be correct. That is just asinine. Um, it's quite annoying. It is quite annoying, I assure you. I'm nervous to put him here and have him do the shotgun thing because I feel it's somehow I'm going to set the car on fire. Uh, which I've been having a huge problem with that happening too lately. Things setting cars on fire. Despite the fact they shouldn't be hitting them at all. Got some advent here. But now I'm just complaining about the game. Anyways, uh, let's kill Pretty Boy here. Did that not count for activating Lost? Because I feel like... And call me crazy, but I feel like it should have. Um, I don't want to go here because I'd have to shoot you. That doesn't seem like the neighborly thing to do. Moving to designated coordinates. I didn't get a notice though that the Lost were coming. I'm pretty positive. Yes, rip him to shreds. This is probably one of my favorite weapons in the entire game. Check it, check it out. 400, that's not very much. Uh, unfortunately, your running gun is not up, which stinks because you could be useful, but no, you're not really. You can take a shot at this guy. You could always try. 63 is really not that bad. Bada bing. Hey, there we go. That guy doesn't have cover anymore either. Let us uh, indeed toss him some ammo. Uh, I mean, I could use the car's cover, but it's not really even helpful. Let's 
it's even helpful at this point. Uh, let's see if you can murder him. No, that's not really great. That's not exactly what I meant. This will let the car up. Not exactly what I'm going for. Heading to that location. Will you blow up the car? That will blow up the car. This, it says, now you're my witness. This says it will not. And I trust it for some reason. I mean, this seems like a reasonable thing to do, I guess. It's not going to kill him, but it should kill that. And I think we get bonus points for killing the objective early, or completing the objective early. Might be making that up. I don't know, 8,000 seems like a lot for destroying a relay. Hey, I'm better than 140 people. Okay, so he must have friends back there. Okay, and no, we're not all grouped together is part of my issue with this. And that's not where I wanted to send you. If you say so. Yay, Miss Clicks! That's exactly what I expected to find, except I wanted to do it on the first move, not the second. So we're not gonna be able to kill a lot this turn. Let's move you up, because we're gonna we're gonna use you to do the sweet shotgun thing, which I could have done right now. Crap. I had run a gun on him. Whoops. Set them up and knock them down. Yes, sir. You heard correctly. Wish there was some cover here, but um, some asshole came by and shot it all up. I don't think I'm going to be able to get more than two, which kind of stinks, to be honest. Yeah, I'm wasting time. Yeah, it's either going to be these two or these two. That's kind of what I thought was going to happen. Let's go ahead and do these two, just because I'll blow up this guy's cover. And blowing up cover is always kind of cool, right? That guy's going to stasis. This friend will bodily stasis as well. You can see him. That's no thank you. That's a crap chance. Sunglasses off, it's dark. That's why you missed. You can't see anybody no matter what I do with you. Kind of feel like I should just. They won't know I'm back here, so they shouldn't. They have to run here to flank him. And they don't know I'm back there, so they shouldn't just run there. They might, but they shouldn't. Right? Oh, uh, what else are you gonna do? Oh, you can do this. Doesn't give you any defenses though, if I remember correctly. Yeah, it is worth a shot. He had a real life chance of like 10% if you ask me, but. What you gonna do? You gonna stand right there? Oh my god, I only wish you would stay that grouped up, but. I know you will not. Alright, so she won't be able to slice and dice anybody. She's especially not going to be able to do it now if she's stasis. You're going to stasis him. Let's see what uh, let's see what our last buddy here does. There he goes. Now he's going to spot us in the back. Yeah, I'm not going to let that fly. You just became. Public enemy number one. I'm doing something. You were doing something. Good call. Good call on that something. All right. No, do not cut up your friend. Uh, not sure why he has such a high defense against somebody with Blade Master, but whatever. Cut him up anyways. Ah, you suck up, bitch. I was a ninety percent. Uh. This is upsetting, because I really wanted to use his uh, shred, shred Storm Cannon right now. Right, you got Shred Storm? Just got a Shred Gun. Still, it's what I wanted from life. Not, not this, really. 
So I still think we're in a decent spot. Right? You could be in a lot. Nope, don't shoot your buddy. Uh, the guy that's standing right in front of you, you only have an 83% chance to hit for some reason. That's odd. I guess you are a lieutenant. Uh, please don't miss this. Oh, God, you grazed him? No, not really. He was right there. Also, he's only worth 700 points. Which uh, does not make me happy either. Okay, so you can reload. Uh, what else can you do for me? I think you'll get some vision if you come here, but I'm not really positive. No, not quite. But if you throw a plasma grenade... I'm pretty sure that hits both of them. I really don't know, I guess. I can't remember where they were. I think one is actually right here, so perhaps that's not going to do what I want from life. Not that... XCOM would ever not do what I want from life. Uh, what else are you going to use at the Absurdum? Come on. Just throw it. Just throw it and see if we hit somebody. It's not like you got anything else to do this turn. Okay, you hit one of them. Now you can see him at least. Also, he burst into flames. Uh, you just manifested into flames somehow. Sure, it was intentional. I guess that thing I was really hoping you'd do. Hot you, buddy. Holy warrior? <laughs> that other thing I was hoping you were going to do. So now my guy can run up to you and miss a shot, which will be awesome. You are standing in flames. Despite the fact that you're not actually on fire. Alright, we got to end this this turn. It's going on way too long. The game's pissed. I don't blame it. I'm kind of pissed too. Um... So, this actually gives us a really good angle, I believe, to shoot all of these guys. Uh, I hope so. I hope I'm not getting too close. I'm afraid this is too far to hit that guy in the back. This is too close to hit all of them because this gun is terrible about being right up close. Never get this close and this is why. And I knew this too. I shouldn't have done this. Because look, you can never hit this person that's right in front. Never, ever, ever. It does not care. It will not let you. I knew that too. I should have. And like nothing I can do will target the sectoid. Even if I put my mouse right on him, which usually works. Nah, doesn't care. Alright, well I guess we're not doing that. Ah, but you have to reload, so you really can't do anything else. That's so annoying. So annoying. Uh, nope, don't hit him. Nope, don't hit him. Yes, do please murder this man. Are you gonna have in stasis, aren't you? So he loses Holy Warrior, but it doesn't count as a quote unquote kill. So this that guy's still just living the dream right here. But I guess it works out. We didn't commit to anything. Because now we can just do this. Uh, I'm not sure why you're not letting me pick where I want to stand, but I guess it doesn't matter. We'll just call it a day, and we're not ending it this turn now, because, you know, 100 points, ugh. Because we're going to have to wait for this guy to, you know, shoot somebody, presumably. And I wouldn't be too terribly surprised if this guy stays is this one we kill him too. Uh, just because reasons. I'm trusting you here. Don't do that, I get people killed. Or damage. Fantastic. I might have him. Yeah. Maybe. Zero percent chance to graze. And stasis. So now we are guaranteed to get even less points for these guys. And everyone's standing out in the open. Nobody has Blade Master. Well, they have Blade Master. Uh, what's the one I'm thinking of? Uh, the close, close quarter combat equivalent of uh, swords. Whatever that is. However, Stasis seems to. Ah, you bitch. 
was going to say, Stasis seems to be off of cooldown, so perhaps they're just going to do that, but <laughs> no. Now I'm worth less points. Fantastic. What are we netting now? 500. Disgusting. Disgusting. Oh, F you. Yeah, rip them to shreds. Dodge this asshole. And that's it. Not too bad. It was a lot of fun. Heck, I'm just happy we got to play it today. Come on. I think top guy was 30,000. We're not going to get that close to that. Get another 500 for the enemy killed. Over 26, though. Pretty happy with that. Hey, alright. Where's that put us? 26. I'm kind of surprised. Kind of surprised we weren't closer up. But a lot of people hitting the 27. Excuse me, I assume that's the uh, RNG just making so those guys wouldn't have... Oh my god, excuse me. Stasis is at the death of the last turn, in which case we probably would have got a couple more hundred. Um, that lady wouldn't have gotten shot. That's a couple points we would have gotten there too. We would have ended it a turn earlier and got some more time. So those are some things. Plus, I mean, if you look at these guys, they're completing it in four minutes. I mean, that's ridiculously good. I spent 11. Now they're probably not commentating, but still, that's pretty good. That's a lot of the points too. But, oh well. It was a lot of fun. Thank you guys so much for coming by. I hope you enjoyed it. I did. Do leave a like and subscribe, and we'll see you tomorrow with another episode. Have a good day.